Hi guys, it's Megan. Welcome back to my channel. So if you don't know who this is, he has been recently featured in a previous video. Go, let's just do this. Say Megan. Say it. Let's just do this. Say it. Dab, dab, dab. So today he is here. <laughs> this is the voice of my dad does my voiceover. And he will be answering some questions on makeup. So I have a list of questions here about makeup to see how much you really know Not about a lot. makeup. So I have 10 questions here, and if he gets it right, then he gets a point. If he gets it wrong, then I get a point. And we'll see who wins at the end. Okay. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video and share it with all your friends. And without further ado, let's just get on with the video. What is this brush called? What's it called? Yes, oh, I'll give you options. That's my shaving brush. No, it's not. I have some options. Okay, give me options. And it is not meant for shaving. Okay. Kabiki, Kabuki, Kaduchi, Kadukai. What? <laughs> Kadukai. No. Okay. Did you say no? <laughs> like, I'm supposed to know that? <laughs> well, you said use it for shaving. So. Well. Kabiki, Kabuki, Kaduchi. Kaduchi. Kabiki or Kabuki? <laughs> well, it's not Kabuki. That's Japanese theater. It's Kabuki! No! Yes, it is. Kabuki. Read it. Point for me. Okay. Ding, 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 ding. What? the power of makeup challenge the power of makeup challenge it's a challenge on YouTube I don't know I don't and, watch YouTube okay well do you want to lose this competition um, the power of makeup power of makeup challenge is you put on makeup and look like your favorite superhero oh my gosh. I have no idea <laughs> okay the power of makeup challenge is where you do half your face with like full out makeup and the other half you leave no makeup so it's like yeah. The difference. All right, next. Uh -huh. Ding, 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 point for me. What does e.l.f. stand for? It's a makeup brand, so think in terms of makeup. What does e.l.f. stand for? E-L-F. E-L-F, and it's makeup? It's Yeah, it's a makeup brand. Enriched Living Foundation. No. It stands for Excellent Living Foundation. Okay, it doesn't have anything to do with foundation. It has to do it, because with... Because it, it has every single like makeup item, so it's not just going to be foundation. Um, exciting, loving, and fun. No. What is it? Eyes, lips, face. Eyes, lips, face. That makes sense. Elf. Point Eyes, for lips, me. Face. That's three okay. to zero. All right. Okay. Oh, this one you might get. Yeah. What is the first thing you apply? Blush, foundation, concealer, primer, or bronzer? Well, if you're painting, you need to prime the surface first. So I'm going to say primer. Ding, ding, ding. That's one to three. Good okay. job. So I have this picture, and yes. it's of two palettes. Which one is the cool toned palette, and which one is the warm toned palette? The cool is the square ones, and the warm are the round ones. Ding, ding, ding. Why? Because the square ones, those look like the colors they'd wear in Frozen, and Frozen was cold, and that's cool, so that's cool. That's my answer. I'm sticking to it. You know, it's a 50-50 answer, so whatever. So I get a point. What gives your face definition? Concealer. My face? Oh my gosh. What gives a face? Okay. Definition. Concealer, blush, bronzer, or foundation? What gives it? Definition. Definition. What makes it defined? Um, concealer, <laughs> blush, bronzer, or foundation? I'm going to say foundation. Uh, mm. Bronzer. For me. Yes, but that was too late. Uh, I think this, this, this is what gives my face definition. You have so many gray hair. I do. Wait, okay. So I fill in my eyebrows. Can I no, fill in your... No, no. No, yes, please. No, let's go next. No, can I fill in your... No. <laughs> no. Why not? Please? Fill it in my... Please. No. Okay, fine. Next. True or false, putting red lipstick under your eyes can brighten them. Lipstick under your eyes? L yes, listen. False. Putting listen. Okay. Putting red lipstick under your eyes can brighten them and cancel circles. Dark false. Circles. It's true. You don't put lipstick under your eyes. It's I've true. never seen you done that. I haven't I've done it. Okay. Bonus points. Bonus question plus two points. Does it work? Like, it's it's this theory and it's been tested before and like people who like really try big to make it, makeup but, like, theory out there i mean like when you do it on There's youtube makeup does it work all over. uh no true you got um two points 
on I've that. never seen anybody walk around. Have you seen anybody walk around with lipstick under their eyes? No, but you put it on first, and then you put on your foundation. What do these mean? Matte and dewy. Matte and dewy. Mm -hmm. Dewey's that kid from Malcolm in the Middle. <laughs> <laughs> he used to watch that show all the time. And Matt was his older brother. Matt and Dewey. No. Um, I'm going to give you another chance. Remember, this is a makeup knowledge quiz. Okay. So it's about makeup. makeup. Uh, Dewey means it's wet, and Matt means it's dry. Mm, I'm going to say no. Because Matt means there's no shine, and Dewey okay. means it's shiny. But All right. no. no you don't if you think it. I'm right, say so in the comments below. And now you do it. I'm a YouTuber. Thank you. <laughs> This is the NYX color correcting palette. We're gonna go through these, and NYX is you're going to figure out what these different colors are used for. If I'm going to a 1980s party, I'm gonna use this one up here for eyeshadow. Um, this one could be used for eyeshadow also. I have no idea what these are. I've okay. never seen any of these colors on you. And the green is used, but I've never seen you use okay. that. So, like I said with the red lipstick, it's used before you apply everything, and then you put foundation and concealer and stuff on top. So, why would you apply green to your face? To make you look envious. Why would you apply purple on your face? Um, to make you look like a witch. Why would you apply yellow on your face? To make you look jaundiced. What does that even mean? So what a color correcting palette does is it cancels out the colors on the opposite side of the wheel. So let's say you have dark circles under your eyes, which would be a bluish color, like if it's a light blue, that's why you would maybe apply red because you know you have blue circles, red lipstick, but you would use the orange or the red colors. If you have right. red it's spots, so boring. if you have red spots okay. from blemishes, you would apply the green okay. to cancel out. I got that point right. So. so that was all the questions that I had prepared for today. I obviously won. So I won and you lost. And what because I win? won, that means you have to take me shopping at Ulta tomorrow. <laughs> no. I won. Obviously, you know nothing about makeup. Like, I didn't think you was going to know anything about makeup. Um, I know. I love you. So that is all I have for you guys today. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe and leave a comment. Stop it! <laughs> Dad! And I will see you in my next video. Bye! Bye! Okay. That's your outro. <laughs> dab, dab, dab. It's a mannequin challenge. Dun, 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 dun.